the best example I can use as it relates to how technology and social media is disrupting our connections. One of the most powerful things that can grease the wheels as it relates to connections between humans is what's called triangulation. So let's say if I'm at an art museum and I'm by myself and I'm looking at a piece of art and a stranger walks up next to me and they are also looking at that piece of art, that piece of art becomes a triangulation point and I might be able to say something like, hey, that's a really nice shade of blue. So that triangulation point all of a sudden breaks the ice. Similarly, have you ever been on an airplane and your plane gets delayed? All of a sudden, that becomes a community, right? Because you all have a common enemy in the, in the delay. <laughs> that becomes a triangulation point, and you start to break the ice, don't you? You have a common thing. That's why associations like crew are so impactful, because you have a common triangulation point. So here's the problem with technology, is if I'm at that art museum, and I'm instead looking at my device, there's no triangulation point. That person can come up next to me, and they'd have no idea what I'm interacting with, and so that cuts off that mutual point for connection. So that's the big thing of technology, is it's got our heads down when we should be up connecting with others.